Mike, what do you got for me? Aaron, did you handle that? All right, I'll bite. What's up with the ball, Clava? Who's this guy? Administrative results. Administrative results. What the hell is an administrative results? He's a YouTuber. A YouTuber. Why the ball club? Doesn't matter, and I don't pay you to ask questions. Yeah, barely pay me at all. I'll make it happen. All right. My God, it's hot here. It's actually not that bad. Man, being a YouTuber seems like a lot of fun. I don't know why I picked up this whole assassin gig. This job sucks. Get it, man. Where is this guy? Hey, man! That's a really cool raptor! That's him, all right. Are you okay? Uh, What's going on? Savio, run! Oh run, God. save yourself! I want you to know I'm sorry I had to be this way. I actually do like the channel. I knew this day would come. Why do you wear the balaclava? Nobody cared who I was before the mask. If I took that off, would you die? It would be extremely painful. You're a big guy. For you. What have I done? Oh, what the heck? Hey, don't move. Hey, don't move. I take it, you're the cameraman. Listen, I, I think I've made a terrible mistake. Savio, yeah. right? Yeah, that's right. I don't know if you figure it out by now, but I'm, um, I'm an assassin by trade. Business sucks. It's, um, it's always a sad day, I should say, and I would, I'd like to get a new job. I think I'm gonna get out of this line of work. 
Well, we might have a spot to fill here. I mean, you killed my boss and he was about to unmask. Well, do you think anyone would tell if I take his spot? I mean, the guy wore a balaclava. You guys kind of sound the same, look the same. Take your glasses off real fast. Don't move. What the hell are you doing? I think that could work. Well, the question is, what do we do about him now? The admin is dead. Long live the admin. 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 If you're seeing this, that means I'm dead. <laughs> Gentlemen, to be honest with you, change is scary. Change is something that brings discomfort and discomfort is part of growing. And I'm gonna be frank with you, I was actually pretty nervous to unmask because there was this level of comfort that I had getting to wear the balaclava that gave me that final shred of privacy. Because I don't know if you know this, having a following of 500,000 plus people on YouTube at this time of filming is pretty wild and there's a lot of people that will look into your life and i've been, actually been doxxed before of course and though they doxxed i wasn't going to let them dictate the terms of my unmasking because yet again i also knew that i was planning to do that to be completely honest with you i am excited i think this shift is a critical shift it is one of those shifts that it could be a make or break if i can't hack youtube without wearing a ball of clava then maybe i shouldn't be a youtuber it is exciting it is a scary shift but it is a necessary one. And I think that the Administrative Results channel will still be the same fun and reckless chaos because I am still the same big chimp with or without a balaclava. So why the balaclava? Well, the balaclava came about as a need of necessity because at the time of me forming my channel, I was still a member of law enforcement. I'm no longer a member. I have quit since 2021 due to the mandatory vaccine orders that came out because of all the that political environment. And at the time though, I wanted to have a creative outlet and I do love firearms. And I was like, well, I mean, I could mash the two together, but then I was worried about the image that it could portray upon me to my department. Because if you ask any police officer or law enforcement guy, their biggest fear is not big bad criminals, but their biggest fear is internal affairs. And I did not want internal affairs come sniffing around my personal life like that. And I wanted the freedom of movement that that would offer. And while it's kind of silly in my head, I was like, well, a layer of uh, plausible deniability would be nice. So hence the mask. And I chose the Arcturix Leaf Ball Club because of Christian Craighead of how good he looked. And he was a lot of the inspiration for that look. And it just kind of stuck. And that was one thing I used and that became part of the identity as a channel. And I always knew in the back of my head that hey, this would eventually end and I want to close this chapter out and move on from the balaclava. So why the unmasking? Well, I knew in the back of my head that I always was going to do this. I wanted to let the balaclava lore play out. And I wanted to use her and I liked having it and I liked that layer of privacy. As thin as my layer of privacy has become, this is now the final shroud of privacy leaving my life in metaphorically terms speaking. So in my personal life too, the balaclava in the channel is one of my worst kept secrets. Like a lot of, pretty much all my friends and a lot of acquaintances know about the channel. And so now it's kind of like, oh, it's just, it's just for strangers at that point. But now it's like, well, what's the point of that? It's like the worst kept secret. I felt like too, it's holding me back from, from things I wanted to do as far as like LARP videos go. Certain things, I, I remember there was moments this year and more so this year I'd say where I wanted to do certain videos and I was like, ah, Ball Club feels like it's getting in the way. And I don't like that feeling. I do not like that feeling at all because I want to make the best, <laughs> the best you know, mediocre YouTube LARP videos that I can, right? So I felt like it was getting in the way of that aspect. And I'm actually excited because yeah, this is a big change. This is a big shift in one's life. You know, the final layer of privacy, whoop, gone. So if the price to pay for making as good of content in the Second Amendment 
space that I can is losing that final layer of privacy, then I'll happily pay that price because to me it is worth it. The audience is worth it and I will do that. I've seen a plethora of comments when I posted a teaser saying, no, don't unmask, don't unmask. We love the ball cloud, we love the mystery. Technically, I still left you with some mystery. Ultimately, gentlemen, I am excited. Change is necessary to grow as a person, so this is no different. And I always wanna be evolving and trying to make the best content that I can for you guys. So I'm looking forward to what the future has in store. As always, gentlemen, stay easy, stay breezy. I'll catch you guys on the flip.